Hi, this is Griffin with Wayson Furniture. Today we're going to be building our Better Homes and Gardens 9 Cube Organizer. This is our rustic gray finish and it can be found on Walmart.com. Before you start, you want to make sure that none of your pieces are missing, none of the panels have any damage to them, and that you have all your hardware. If you have any problems, you can call this number on the front of the manual and we'll get you taken care of. Uh, if everything's good to go, we can be ready to assemble. For step one, you're going to want to have two B panels and eight cam bolts. Screw them in to the four pre-drilled holes. Screw them in until this larger ring is flush with the panel. For step two, you're going to want to have 16 plastic dowel pieces and your six D panels. Start by inserting four dowels into only two of the panels. When putting in the dowels, leave one and a quarter inch sticking out. For the remaining D panels, you only want to insert two dowels into them. For step three, you're going to want to have your two C panels and eight cam locks. On these cam locks, there is one dash that is longer and pointier than the rest. You want to point this cam lock towards the outside of the panel, towards the pre-drilled hole. Insert these eight cam locks into your two C panels. For step four, you're going to want to grab your six D panels and your two C panels. Uh, position your two D panels with wood dowels on both ends in the middle and then the remaining four on the outside. Start by grabbing uh, your D panel and then your C panel and position the cam locks towards the left. Slide in like so, and then slide in your other D panel. Next, grab your other C panel, and again, remember, cam locks to the left. Next, attach your D panels, and these dowels should be sticking through on both sides. So you want to insert them in where there are pre-drilled holes, then these dowels will be pointing away from the structure. For step five, you're going to want to grab your two B panels and attach them to the structure by inserting these cam bolts into the cam locks. Once that you have them slid in, you can tighten them by turning clockwise. Repeat this process for the other side. For step six, you're going to want to have eight of these longer screws and eight of these caps and then your two A panels. Go ahead and attach your A panels to your structure. And then to secure it, screw it in with four screws. Now you want to do the same thing for this other 8 panel. Once you have inserted all 8 bolts, uh, you can then cover them with the caps. Continuing with step 6, you want to grab your safety strap, a washer, and a screw. 
and go ahead and screw it on. You want to make sure you are doing this on the top and you can check that this is the top but if you look down you will not see any of the cam locks.